In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a user to a shared mailbox, meaning I'm going to grant them access so they can access this shared mailbox. And afterwards, I'm going to show you how to add that shared mailbox inside of their Outlook. Those are a couple of different things that we need to take care of. It's one thing to grant access, but it's another to actually add it inside of their Outlook. So here we are in Exchange Admin Center. And if you're here on the left column, we're going to accept expand the recipients. Then we're going to select the groups. Why groups? Because this is where the shared mailbox boxes are for different groups and departments. In this case, we're going to concentrate on finance group and we're going to add a member to it called Jasmine Long. So in order to have access to this mail, shared mailbox, you have to become a member. So now that we have a column that expands our finance group shared mailbox, we're going to select members here. And then on the bottom here where it says members, we're going to underneath it select view all and manage members. From here on out, we're going to add a member. Remember, we're going to add Jasmine Long. So I'm going to select click here on the plus and say add members. And of course, I'm going to get a list here of people I can add or I can simply do a search. But since Jasmine Long is already here, we're going to select her. I'm going to click add. Now Jasmine Long has going to have access to the finance group uh, shared email. Now we're going to go inside of her outlook so here it is you can see that this is jasmine long longed in and the way we do this is by right clicking the folder here and then we're going to click add a shared folder this is where it's a little bit misleading because uh, it's a shared mailbox and as, as you've noticed she gets a notification right away at this time so within 20 seconds or maybe 10 seconds that she was added to this shared mailbox. So we're going to simply look for the group that we've added, which is finance group. Here it is. We're going to select that and we're going to add it. And since we've added, we can see the finance group has been added into our left column here. And if we expand it, now she has access to the inbox and can send on behalf of this group. And that's how you add it. If you appreciate this video, please click a like button or leave a comment or also subscribe. Thank you very much. I hope you have a wonderful day.